Spencer, you had a couple of stats that you were talking about that you saw an ad week on, week on that as well. Yeah, they just published an article that says that 55% of people trust the advice of influencers and 60% of women polled have bought a product from an influencer in the last year. And I mean, this is a very interesting trend for especially in influencer marketing because you have the reach that you cannot get with with certain other like social media creators or creators in general, but that doesn't always lend to performance. And we've seen that sometimes influencers can even fake their reach. Um, we have influencers renting a private jet for an hour to take pictures for Instagram. We have the advent of fashion, which is literally just to have different outfits on Instagram. We have people faking sponsored content so they can get ad dollars from real sponsored content. And we have to vet all of those options as an agency consistently, even in the podcast space. It's like, do you have a lot of followers? Yes. But will they buy this product? Do they align with the brand values of this advertiser? Maybe not. So it's definitely something that we work within as a DR agency, but it's something to, to keep in mind as we go into the economic downturn as well.